nothing in 2020 is boring and it seems everything is extra extra watch a youtube video all about it and so now i'm talking about c 2019 comet y2 y4 atlas which is both brightening and breaking up at the same time it's happened to me before and so even though reports have it fragmenting it is also getting brighter so now we're at a 6.2 magnitude and it's 4.5 magnitude if uh you want to be able to see it with your naked eye with my naked eyes i saw the fall in rain but more interestingly this bad boy or girl depending on your preference won't be crossing earth's ecliptic until the 27th of april so that's fascinating you know that's definitely fascinating and so we will have to check out because it is my belief that the sun and comets and then the planets around them have interactions when you have close approaches and so we are definitely going to be on super high alert for weird weather earthquakes volcanoes and just general demons crawling out of the bottomless pit and attacking humans or some shit you know as my recommendation and i personally believe in space force why was hurricane season in 2019 so good to the americas even though we had dorian and a bunch of hurricanes come and get real close to the coast but not do any damage because of the atmospheric defense team space force and asteroid by club that is my belief and it will be proven this hurricane season and i also believe that they shot this thing with something lasers probably um and blew it to bits but they blew it to bits when like as it started breaking up as it breaks up it's the debris is hopefully not going to be affecting earth any more than it would have and so what type of a gravitational interaction would it have with everything around it as it zips past the sun and then goes to out back to orbit we will have to check out and whereas youtube likes to tell you we're on some imminent catastrophe cycle and doom is approaching there's nothing you can do about it that is not my attitude nor is it the attitude of astro fight club and so i think there are people out there playing defense for us so that is always fascinating you know there are good guys and bad guys bro that's just how it is and so we are definitely seeing your normal amount of strangeness with a giant comet that comes around and has a coma a nucleus and i mean the coma if you put the whole comet together it's like coma nucleus tail and so the coma nucleus and tail are as big as the sun so that's fascinating you never know what's going to happen and i would guess we we're going to see an uptick in near-earth asteroids the meteorites meteors over the next month or two because this will not pass by the sun until the end of may and even the sky seems to be a bit different lately well over the last year or two and so anything goes in 2020 that seems like the deal yo and with the fragmenting breakup and possible zipping zapping of space force we have an orbit change no it's not detrimental to the life on the planet asterisk nakamoto smoto japan reports on some unusual changes in the orbit of this comet noting that suddenly non-gravitational effects have appeared beginning around march 31st and these effects appear to be quite large below are his revised elements from 1053 observations spanning 2017 december 28th and so yeah comets are like dirty cat dragon snowball animals that are magic and flaming in the sky running around the sun like a jet ring so you never know what they're gonna do it's best to stay on guard but this doesn't it didn't push into earth or anything but it did have some significant changes to its orbit which is fascinating we will check more out into that story but i would just let you know that 2020 is something extra 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 special with surprises but yeah the orbit has changed and pro astronomers like to say that comets do not interact with the sun which i don't believe at all 
And I believe we're going to see some type of a pretty decent coronal mass ejection as the sun whips around the, or as the comet whips around the sun. So definitely we will be watching to see what type of major CME, coronal mass ejection, we get in the next month or two. And I can almost guarantee you that there's going to be a big CME, man. It, it happens every single time. I think one time I put together a video showing all the interactions between the comets and the sun. But scientists like to uh, stay in whatever they believe. They must be fixed signs. Where I'm Sagittarius, I'm mutable. Anyway, this is your update. Yeah, the comet is both brightening, breaking up, and changing its orbit. So, this romantic comedy keeps getting more interesting. That's it's not really that romantic, nor is it that funny. Okay, love y'all. Y'all are great. Stay cool. And thank you for being a member of Asteroid Fight Club. Peace out. God bless everyone. Stay cool.